Hi friends. In this lecture, we will study about solution of a linear differential equation. So this is the third shortcut method. So general formula is f of d of y equal to q of x. So already we have studied about in case of e raised to ax, and the second one is either sin or cos. So now in this method, q of x equal to x raised to m. So how to find out the p i? So p i equal to one upon f of d into q of x. Q of x is x raised to m. So in case of this, we are take the least degree term common in f of d and convert into the form one plus pi of x. See in this one upon d square plus three d plus two. So least degree term is this is constant term. So we have to take this minus two common one upon. So this is one minus. So remaining whole term upon this value. So d square plus three d upon two. And we are using these two formulas. We are using any one of the formula, and we are expanding this. One upon one minus d. That is one plus d plus d square plus d cube and so on. In case of one upon one plus d, if here plus sign is there, we have to write alternately plus and minus one minus d plus d square minus d cube and so on. We are using these two notations and we are simplifying this. So in case of this one minus d form, one minus d means one plus d plus d square so on one plus d. D means we have to consider this whole thing upon two, upon two and so on. So see one example. Solve d cube y by d x cube plus eight y equal to x raised to four plus two x plus one. So first of all, find the complementary function. For this, we are equating f of d to zero. So this is m cube plus eight equal to zero. Again, we are using the formula of a cube plus b cube. So a cube plus b cube is a plus b into a square minus a b plus b square. So a value is m, b value is eight. Can be write as two cube. So b value is So a plus b m plus two m square minus two m plus four equal to zero. Separately we are equating this is zero and this is zero. M plus two equal to zero means we will get m equal to minus two. So using the formula minus b plus r minus root of b square minus four ac upon two a, we will get here one plus r minus root three i. One plus r minus so. Here we are using the condition of imaginary value alpha plus r minus beta i. So alpha value is one, beta value is root three. So right here, so right already C one I written C two cos root three x plus C three. So here, right C to already C one I added here. C one e raised to minus two x plus C two cos root three x plus C three sine root three x into e raised to x. So I missed here. Here, right C two and here C three e raised to x. Now p i equal to one upon f of d. That is d cube plus eight into x raised to four plus two x plus one. Take the least degree term. This is constant term. I have to take out eight into one plus d cube upon eight into x raised to four plus two x plus one. Now it is in the form of one upon one plus d. D means here d cube by eight. That is one minus d plus d square minus d cube and So on, so one minus d d means d cube by eight plus d square that is d cube by eight whole square and so on into 
x raised to 4 plus 2x plus 1. So simply multiply this 1 into x raised to 4 plus 2x plus 1 d cube by 8 into this value plus so we can write down that d raised to 6 upon 64 into x raised to 4 uh, 2x plus 1 and so on. So here d cube means we have to differentiate this function 3 times. So d cube of x raised to 4 plus 2x plus 1. So we can write down this d cube is d square into d. So d of x cube plus 2 sorry x raised to 4 plus 2x plus 1 x raised to 4 derivative 4x cube plus 2 again write down this d square is d into d so differentiate this so derivative of 4x cube x cube means 3x square 3x square into 4 that is 12x square constant is 0 again d so derivative of x square is 2x 2 into 12 that is 24x so d cube of x raised to 4 plus 2x plus 1 equal to 24x. So similarly d raised to 4 but here only d raised to 6 is there whenever this value is more than this simply this derivative is 0. So you can stop the process here if you consider any term so after this every term will be 0 you have to stop here. So this is x raised to 4 plus 2x plus 1 minus 1 by 8 into 24x. So cancel this, how many times, 3 times, so x raised to 4 plus 2x plus 1 minus 3x, simplify this, so x raised to 4, so 2x minus 3x is minus x plus 1 upon 8, therefore general solution y equal to cf plus pi, write the value of cf and PA. So, solve these examples.